Well, you know what? You know, I can't even remember what you have to do to get in over to the uh, Don Piante. He's actually over here. Not not the Piana parlor. Actually, he's uh, in here. It's through this door, but this door is locked. I just built me ground stomping the thing. You know, I think I remember what I have to do. I can't carry any more items. God dang it. Uh, sure, I'll sell some bull crap. Sure, I'll sell the dizzy doll because I'm just gonna buy another one. And fucking sleepy sheep, I don't need this. Actually, hmm. Unless I could use the power punch. Buy the dried shroom. Buy the dizzy dial. Wait a bite. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Alrighty, mister. What color is your mustache? Um. Uh. Black? Oops, what's wrong with me? That wasn't the right question at all. Uh, let's try this again. Hmm, okay, mister. What's your favorite color? Crap, I can't remember the answer to this. Uh. Shit. I think there was something you had to do to actually get the answers to this to figure out what to do here, but I just remember. So. Rick. What's the answer to this? Huh. Oh yeah, okay, it's yellow. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Well, you check out. You know the password. So, um, you must be an acquaintance of Don Pianda. Good for you. You can go through the door. Go on with your bad self. Alright. What's that? What's up, you wise guy? I ain't too jolly today. If you got beef, spread out quick. This gonna hurt. Excuse me? You wanna? You want me to give you a ticket for the blimp? See now, to me, that's funny. You stand-up comedian? No, you ought to be. Got some nerve asking me for that. I'm Don Piana. I'm a crying baby's weep. You want I should run this bum out and derail, boss? Look at him. What a rube. You must like pain, funny guy. If you're just looking for trouble or what? Not so fast, boys. I like this kid's gumption. Just came talk. Just came talk, no? Ain't that ain't crime. So we talk. You boys can wait till we're done before you rough them up, you got it? So I gotta assume you got a reason for wanting to take a photo blimp out with it. What's that? You wanna help some broad who got self kidnapped? And to rescue this dame, you got collecting the crystal stars? The crystal stars? Hey, boss, ain't those things in that legend about that ancient treasure? Ben, you're such a dope. Hey, boss, this knucklehead believes in fairy tales. Bite your tongue. Don't listen to that. L don't listen to that. Without the treasure as real as I am. Yeah, and you look pretty real. <laughs> I'm sorry. Everybody just shut. I don't care if the treasure is real or not. Get me? But I tell you, I can't help like a guy who wants to rescue some scut he fell for. I made my decision. You do me a little favor and you can get your blimp ticket. Sounds fair, right? I'm not in light entirely sure I like the sound of this. It's easy. It's nothing. It's less than nothing. See, the thing is, my daughter eloped with one of my young associates. They vanished, but it wasn't too long ago that they did. They ought to still be nearby. You got to find my daughter, Francisca, and this Frankie, and, and bring them both here. If you're unable to bring them here, now all he's got to do is tell them what they are. Then I shall deal, sell this mat quickly, and with what is known as extreme prejudice. Boss! We don't know nothing about this guy. You can't run on some goof, goofball for this dumb. Hey, yeah, boss, Vinny's right. Leave it to him. To, leave it to us to find Francisca. Quiet, you! It's cause you lugs can't find it that I gotta swallow my pride and ask this guy. 
Hope you don't say make a complaint about my decision. You making complaints? No, boss. Whatever you say goes, boss. I don't know what I was thinking, boss. It won't happen again, boss. You're the boss, boss. Have we said boss enough today? Seriously? Good. I'm glad we're all in full understanding for one another. So it's settled, yeah? Find my daughter and her friend. Then come see me. Francesca and Franklin look like this. And just so we're clear here. If you don't find my daughter, your luck might turn terrible. <laughs> God, that voice. That accent I just put on that is like, oh god. Right, so. Francisca and Frankie. They are over on the. what is it called? The port of Rogue. I don't know. The docks, there you go. There we go. Docks, down here. Right. Loaded screens and, um. Just gotta head down here. Here they are. What's that? Uh, it doesn't really matter, so talk to. Hey, back off, you creep. I just want something for you. You know, sliding up to people. What? Daddy asked you to find us? And take us to him? Frankie, what should we do? If Daddy finds us now... Oh, I don't know, and the boat's coming in any minute. Dollface, maybe we ought to head back and try to talk to the boss one more time. No, Frankie, don't say that. Don't you know what he'll do for do to you if we do that? Francisca, baby doll. If we can just talk calm like with the boss, he'll understand. Oh, Frankie, my Frankie, don't, don't you love me? Of course I love you, sugar cookie. But then, more than anybody in the whole world. Then let's go, Frankie. Let's run to the ends of the earth if we have to. Hmm. Oh, it's like, okay. But, but, Biscuit, they already found us out. We can't, can't keep running forever. We can, Frankie. The more you try to put out the flames of love, the hotter they burn. Until I marry you, no one will extinguish these flames of passion. No one! Don't you see, mister? I beg you, pretend that you pretend you never saw us. Can you do that? No way, sob sister. But what did you say to me? You terrible, terrible man. <laughs> Fine, have it your way. But we won't go with you. Never. I won't move from this spot. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on. No, bug off. I'm not going anywhere with you. Great. Just great. Alright. Well, actually, he did say if we can't actually bring him here, then tell him where they are, so... Oh, whatever should we do? We have to say something to that Don Bianca fellow. I must say, though, I don't fancy a run of terrible luck. That would be unfortunate. Okay, so we need to head back to his place, so, um, yeah. Okay, so, here we are. What's up? Oh, look who's coming back. The proverbial mustache. Got bright in my room? So give. What you got? You, you know the whereabouts of those two runaways? Sure do, and I'll tell you. Oh, is that true fit? Rogueport Harbor, eh? Oh, that's what it's called, the harbor, duh. Well done, appreciate this favor you've done for me. I'll pay your blimp tickets. Hey, hey, you two Nimrod kids down to Harvard. Now go get them. Daddy, wait. Francisca. Boss, forgive me, boss. I I'm sorry, truly I am. Frankie, so, back you come. Head hung low and wait tail between your legs. No, Daddy, don't hurt him. I'm the one who said we should elope. It was me. But Frankie said no. He said he should come back and talk to you, Daddy. Boss, listen. Don't care what you do to me. I deserve it all for being disloyal. But you gotta forgive her. Forgive you, daughter, boss. That's all I ask. No, Daddy. No, no, no. I'm the bad one. It's my fault. If you're going to punish anyone, punish me. No, boss. All me. It's my responsibility. All to blame right here. Daddy. Boss. Yarg! Enough, quiet, both of you! Francisca, my headstrong die. You, you just stepped in the last favor long ago. And you, Frankie. You're like a son to me. This how, and this how you pay debt to Don Biana? I feel such disappointment here, too. It's like a prison shroom, it's like a poison shroom in my gut. 
Daddy! Boss! Don't ever want to see you mugs again, you hear me? Get out of my sight! Boss you! I don't care you! Just go! That's what you expected to say. Expect me to say, huh? Well, that's what I'm saying. Go, do what you want, even if it means getting married. Oh, Daddy. Dad, no, wait, I mean, boss. Thank you so much, Daddy. Thanks for your blessing. Boss, I'll make your daddy ha a happy woman, I promise. She'll wait for nothing. Enough already, just go. Go! Francisca, seeing you this happy makes me happy too. Congrats, both of course. Frankie, this is great. Ain't, ain't quite what I promised, but hey, things turned out okay, am I right? Goodbye, Daddy. Farewell, and thank you. Still you? Hmm, well, you found my dog guy, come back here. And just look at how things turned out. What a complete and utter soap opera. But hey, deal's a deal. You can have your blimp ticket, like I said. Awesome! Oh no, this guy's got a smile ear to ear. She's, ha she's happy. That's good. Hey, I knew you were the right man for the job. Thanks a bunch, Pally. But I don't want to see that gloomy face of yours no more. Don't ever come back here. All right. Well, it is time. I think. Is it? Hmm. I need to remember if it's time. You know, there is one place. My my, we've done it, Mario. Next up, Glitzville. Oh my God! Email. Let's see what we got. Uh, okay, it's under journal. No, it wasn't. No, it was under gear. Stupid. Okay, mailbox to speed. Coopley. What? Oh, it's him. Awesome, okay. Uh... Right, so here we are. I'm gonna talk to Dazzle. Buy some badges. What have you got? Uh, I want the quick change. I can't actually equip it right now because I don't have enough VP, but it'll be useful. Attack effects Y? I don't want that. Oh my god, who I? I think I did get that at one point. I had like, on one of my saves, I had like all of the attack effects badges on. I don't know why. They're annoying. Um, item hog, what's this? Make it likely that items will appear after battle. Yeah, sure, why the fuck not? Three VP to wear this badge. Well, I'm not gonna use it for anything else. Right. Okay. What's in here? Oh yeah, it's her. Yeah. What does she do? Uh. Oh yeah, that's right. She's like tell you what to do next. Oh yeah. Okay. So. Um, I'll have to chapter three then. Meet you guys over where the blimp is. 